Okay, welcome back, boys and girls. We're gonna continue on with our lesson and we're gonna start with page 104. So we're going to look at jumps this time instead of moving an object in a small amount, we're gonna move in larger amounts. So we're gonna look at Benjamin again using our same rules. The ruler is 12 inches, 12 inches equals one foot. Therefore, one ruler equals one foot. So we're gonna look at Benjamin again and he jumped four rulers and two and a half more inches. I'm going to need an equation to help me solve this problem. I know that Benjamin jumped four rulers and each of those rulers were 12 inches. And then I'm going to add on his two and one half more inches. I know that four times 12 is 48. And then I'm going to add the two and a half more inches, which gives me 50 and one half inches. To figure out the feet, we already know that it was four times 12. So I know that four rulers means four feet. And then I'm just going to add my inches in. He did two and a half more inches. We're gonna look at Jung's jump as well. She did three rulers and four more inches. We're gonna use our same equation, except we're going to do three rulers. And then we're going to add the four more inches. Three times 12 is 36. I'm going to add my four more. I get 40. So I know that Jung jumped 40 inches and she did three rulers, which was three feet and she did four more inches. So she jumped three feet, four inches. What I would like you to do now is try Chris and Elena's. But before I leave, you notice my board's a little boring. So if any of you would like to make a picture or draw a picture, take a picture of it, send it to my email, and we will feature one of your pieces of artwork each time I do a lesson. Thanks for watching.